all right so a lady posted on a tiktok page saying that my boyfriend told me to wear a pretty flowing dress and i got mad at him and said don't tell me how to dress so i wore a cargo pants instead and then this happened a boyfriend proposed to her so she says she ruined her proposal and in a caption she was saying that ladies not every time you fight with your man sometimes it just got your back or something so she's feeling very sad that she would have listened to her boyfriend and wore a floral dress as he has begged her to wear so now in a comment section a lot of people were like you ruin your proposal they were coming for her you see what you have to do people even saying that this man shouldn't have even go ahead to marry her because she doesn't listen to a man so why should he propose and all of that anyways what is your take on this video on this how she ruined her proposal do you think she really ruined her proposal or not let me know your in comment section i have a few reactions on this video people are talking and giving their two cents on this proposal <laughs> so let's go ahead and watch other people's reaction on this video and i'll be back in my own opinion this is such a perfect example of how wedding culture really reinforces femininity standards for women in straight relationships so this young woman knew what she wanted to wear on this day going on this hike i'm guessing with her boyfriend and she was you know completely correct and valid to get pissed off by him telling her what to wear mm -hmm. but then as soon as she finds out that he's proposing to her all of a sudden she starts feeling insecure about the outfit that she picked out and she goes ahead and puts in the caption ladies we don't have to start a fight with men about everything like and the the comments are really sad mm -hmm. because a bunch of girls are saying like oh yeah you should just like not say no when your boyfriend tells you what to wear because like this is what's going to happen to you and it's just such bullshit because if you look at the outfit that the man is wearing in this video, like, his outfit is, like, frumpy and dumpy, yeah. right? Like, she looked cuter than he did. And, like, they both were kind of wearing casual clothes, but I would say that she put her, her outfit together better than his did. In my opinion, she looked better than he did. But yet, like, he's asking her to wear, like, this gorgeous, like, frilly dress and be, like, hyper-feminine, yet he's not playing the role of, like masculinity like I don't see him wearing like a suit and a tie you know like so it just goes to show how even women who ha are strong-minded who have you know their own free will who would never put up with like a man telling them what to do when it comes to wedding culture and the norms we have around weddings and proposals you will see the most femi feminist women feminist women in the world all of a sudden throwing all of their you know values and their sure. agency away mm -hmm. in order to the peer pressure of wedding culture mm -hmm. you know women who are extremely feminist still end up following these very patriarchal traditions that are expected of women in in marriages and proposals so for example they wear the white red wedding dress to symbolize their virginity they you know accept the engagement ring which symbolizes that they are claimed and spoken for whereas you know the man that they are engaged to doesn't have to wear a ring in order to show the world that he's spoken for um and and many feminist women will still end up taking their husband's name yeah. when they get married and i think that the reason why this happens is because so much about weddings and marriage is so romanticized and women's value um, in society and among their peers, among other women, is really based upon how well they play into those like perfect like wedding and proposal stereotypes. Yeah. And it's really sad. 
Every time I come on this app, I'm guaranteed to get pissed at least one fucking time. If I had plans on proposing to my girl and I asked her to put on a dress and she said, no, don't tell me what to wear, now the proposal is off. I know, Shaquille, you're petty. You're not going to propose to the girl you want to propose to just because she said, because how the fuck is your man asking you to wear a dress telling you what to do? When I think of a man telling you what to do, I think of, hey, now that you're with me, you can't wear crop tops no more. Hey, when you go out with your girls, now that you're dating me, nah, you're not going to be wearing all that makeup because you draw too much attention. That's when I, that, when I think of a man telling you what to do, that's what I think of. If he's asking you to put on a dress because he's taking you somewhere, obviously he has plans. But y'all are so stuck on, I don't want a man telling me what to do that <laughs> I'm not proposing no more. Because now, now I'm going to propose on my own. I'm dropping the whole in the wedding i'm dropping all that because you just you just pissed me off i know some of y'all gonna be like well he proposed to her anyway he loved her so all, none of that matters too bad love isn't the only thing you need in a marriage or a relationship to make it work but that's a whole nother conversation for another day this girl ruined her proposal because she didn't want to listen to her boyfriend as y'all can see the caption says my boyfriend told me to wear a pretty flowy dress and i got mad at him and said don't tell me how to dress so i wore cargo pants instead and then this happened mm -hmm. if your man tells you to put on a nice dress that typically means he got something planned for you yeah. a picturesque moment if you catch my drift mm -hmm. even though we can all agree that she definitely put her foot in her mouth i do think that the outfit she has on actually matches the background of the proposal better in my opinion mm -hmm. also girl you got the ring that's all that matters also mm -hmm. it's a good thing that she dressed more practical anyway because the weather went to hell later on it got all cold windy and rainy and that definitely would have ruined her sundress moment mm -hmm. now a lot of people are roasting this girl in her comment section saying that this is going to be a tough marriage because she chose to be hard-headed some people pointed out how aggravated she looked in the video thinking that she was determined to ruin that day regardless my two cents on this she probably just checked the weather ahead of time and saw that it was going to be nasty which is why she chose not to wear a dress however even though she didn't look as dressed up as she wanted to in the moment her and her new fiance were able to make up for it in their engagement photos. Once again, congrats to the happy couple and let me know what you guys think about the situation down below. Okay, so I was just scrolling and I saw this video and this reads, my boyfriend told me to wear a pretty flowy dress and I got mad at him and said, don't tell me how to dress. So I wore cargo pants instead. And then this happened. And people in the comments were being so serious and negative. Like, oh my gosh. I think that this is actually the most hilarious thing I've ever seen. And it's hilarious because he, he like, I'm sure he was like insisting, oh, hey, you should wear this dress. He probably picked out the dress itself. Mm -hmm. Like he was like, no, you should wear this dress. Da -da 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 -da. Like he had this all planned out in his mind. And his girl who was in a mood, she was in a tube because you know, she had probably pieced together that he'd been acting weird the past couple of days. And she was kind of a little bit upset with him said, don't tell me what to do. Don't tell me what to wear. Don't tell me how to dress. And this wise man, whatever his name may be, chose to pick his battles. <laughs> <laughs> chose to pick his battles and not have his girl mad at him on a day where he knew he was going to propose. <laughs> and I appreciate that so much because in the relationship of like in my head, I'm not going to let no man tell me what to wear for a few reasons. One, because men typically don't have a good sense of taste. Like yeah. I haven't met three men that have a good sense of taste. But also, um, I've seen it done so many times and like I've studied this where men will use like a woman and like how she dresses as like a status symbol or like as a way to control her, like for his personal gain, not for her, for his personal gain. Like he isn't trying to control her. He isn't trying to make her do anything that she does not want to do. Um, but she also knows that in the future, that if there, he's taking her on a date and he's telling her how to dress is not to control her because he'd much rather have her than whatever outfit she plans to wear. But he might know something might be, might be going on at that particular event or location or date that she doesn't know that he has planned that she is not privy to. And so maybe... You should allow him, like, maybe you should listen to him because maybe he knows what he's talking about. Just a suggestion. But it's like, 
it's it just seems so great to me i'm kind of getting emotional over it i don't know why but oh uh, and i have no idea about this couple at all nothing about their relationship this is literally the first time i've encountered them but oh is, is that a green flag i would be pissed but that would be a green flag for real one day, some women are going to understand that everything a man says isn't about control, isn't about being a narcissist, just isn't about being a man. Mm -hmm. Why does woman post a video, and I'll tag the person, why does woman post a video talking about her man told her to wear like a flowy dress or something, and then she going to respond in a petty way talking about some, don't try to control what I wear, don't tell me what to wear. Long story short, bro told her to wear something cute because he wanted to propose to her. There's two topics that we could talk about. One, men can never win. Here a man is, he understands who you are. And he probably always, you probably always talked about how you want your engagement yes. photos to be yeah. so, oh, so cute. So he tried to look out for you. He had your best interest, uh -huh. but your funky little attitude kept you from having that moment. Now I understand you probably like it even more because there's a funny story behind it. Uh -huh. But that mentality right there. It, it speaks volumes. I think this just goes to show that sometimes we can be our worst enemy. Due to past trauma, due to what we see online, we see something, we hear something, and then we see it in our own life, and we automatically think, oh my God, this is that negative thing that I saw online. Let me try to prevent this. Sometimes you need to understand who you're dealing with, and you need to understand your person. Mm -hmm. If your man has never tried to control you a day in your life, why do you think he gonna start today? Give him the benefit of the doubt sometimes. Marriage proposal, marriage proposal, marriage proposal, marriage proposal. Please watch that video to understand the context of what we're about to talk about. But I'm going to give you a small synopsis. This young lady and this young man are together, right? This young man tells her, hey, can you please wear a flowery dress or a nice dress or whatever? And she chooses to say, no, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to wear what I want to wear, right? And then chooses to wear cargo long pants and a, a regular tomboy outfit, basically, right? Then they go to this really nice, serene, wooded place or whatever the situation may be. Um, and they're making a video. She's thinking, oh, we're just doing pictures or whatever. Or, you know, just taking a full outfit check or whatever. And then it turns out to be that, no, the boyfriend was proposing to her. You know what I'm saying? Now that your proposal has a quirky little story... Of how it happened, ha 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 ha. It's very funny, but also as well, it shows the fact that like sometimes you just gotta listen to your partner. Mm. I'm not. I'm not saying that men should dictate how women mm -hmm. dress. I'm not saying that. What I'm saying is, is this: that video could have been so much nicer if you would have just listened in that moment. Yeah. In that moment, that's all I'm saying. In that moment. That video could have been so much nicer. You'd have been ready. You'd have been together. Instead, you chose to say, hey, I'm going to do what I want to do. And I'm not going to listen to my partner in this moment. Right? Do I think it, it says that's how your relationship is going to look moving forward? No. I think in that instance, you know what I'm saying? You might have just done something that was personally um, selfish onto yourself. Um, that ruined a surprise that your boyfriend probably have been planning for, what, months? Maybe weeks. I was saying to to get the right place, the right timing, the right lighting, you know, um, waiting to make sure that your nails were done and everything so that you look good while you take the pictures and everything. But I don't know what to tell you. Like and comment in the comment section. Let's talk about this because this is confusing to me. Thank you all so much for sticking around to this point. If you're still here, can you put your thoughts, your comments, your opinion, your suggestion down in the comment section? Did she ruin her proposal? To me though, I don't think the proposal is ruined. What she was wearing... Okay, first of all, the fact that she didn't listen to her boyfriend telling her, okay, this is a floral dress. For me, if I have a boyfriend and boyfriend is telling me, this is what I want you to wear, we're going somewhere... I would listen because of course it's not the kind of person that controls you and tells you oh, don't wear this don't wear that mm -mm, this is too short this is too, mm -mm -mm. I'm not talking about that one I'm talking about is like I want you to wear this and we're going somewhere my mind I'm like okay romantic man where are you taking me to I will wear <laughs> whatever it is because I will wear it but what, what she's even putting on is not bad 
the place they were were like hiking or something, not hiking like in the bush. So it's okay. She's all covered up. It's okay. It's fine. And then the old, the guy wasn't even wearing was wearing something very simple and I don't see how the dress ruined the proposal to me. I feel like the main point is that she felt or her, her boyfriend was trying to control what she's going to wear out and she didn't like it and probably the guy was not convincing enough and one of the things she was like probably because he's trying to plan a proposal it might be a little bit distant maybe for a week he's just acting like all suspicious for a week and all of a sudden he's telling her what to do and she's like you can't tell me what to do <laughs> that can happen as well and that can make it get like that you've been distant all week and now you're telling me so i'm not wearing it i can be stubborn like that as well I can be stubborn like that, like, mm -mm, this is what I want to be, keep yourself. So, it, I, I don't, to me, I don't feel like she wrote that proposal. And people saying that because she didn't listen to her boyfriend, they won't go ahead with the proposal or she's going to ruin her marriage. But like, it's not that deep. It's not that deep. Like, we didn't even know this couple before. This whole thing was when I blew her channel. So, and I don't see how controlling that can be. It's just, a suggestion like okay we're going out can you wear this gown that i like you i like you on this gown can you put on that gown it's going to look good on you like it's just a suggestion and it's fine for even your friend can tell you that oh we're going somewhere um ah, maria can you wear this black dress you I, I really love the black dress on you can you wear it for this outing i'm like okay i was planning to wear a jean and a shirt no 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 don't wear a jean and a shirt just wear a black dress. okay like it's not a controlling kind of outfit so i won't blame her per se and again i don't see anything wrong with what she's wearing i don't see anything wrong with what she's wearing i don't see anything wrong with what she's wearing what she's wearing and what she's wearing is almost the same thing and it suits both of them suits each other and again they went ahead to take another picture for their proposal and anyways congratulations to her <laughs> Let me know your thoughts about this video down in the comment section. Do you think he was trying to control her and she was being stubborn for not listening? Or is not that deep? To me, it's not that deep. Okay? Let me know your thoughts about this video down in the comment section. And thank you all so much for sticking around to this point. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and share and subscribe. And can you turn on the post notification bell so you can get notified when I upload an interesting video like this one. And I'll see you all in my next one.